Helicobacter pylori testing. This test is performed to diagnose an infection with Helicobacter pylori, bacteria that can cause peptic ulcers. So you're asked to get tested when you have symptoms of an ulcer, such as gastrointestinal pain that comes and goes, unexplained weight loss, nausea, and or vomiting. The sample required is a stool sample, a breath sample, or a tissue biopsy of the stomach lining. Helicobacter pylori is very common, especially in developing countries. The bacteria are present in the stomachs and intestines of as many as 50% of the world's population. Most of those affected will never have any symptoms. But the presence of Helicobacter pylori increases the risk of developing ulcers, peptic ulcer disease, chronic gastritis, and gastric or stomach cancer. The bacteria decrease the stomach's ability to produce mucus, making the stomach prone to acid damage and peptic ulcers. There are several different types of Helicobacter pylori testing that can be performed, such as stool antigen test, blood antibody test, urea breath test. An antibody test using a blood sample is not recommended for routine diagnosis or for evaluation of treatment effectiveness. This test detects antibodies to the bacteria and will not distinguish between a present and previous infection. The urea breath test is not typically recommended for young children. Treatment usually involves a combination of antibiotics and drugs to reduce the amount of stomach acid produced. Treatment does not make a person immune, so there is always the potential for becoming infected again. Since the infection is very common, testing is only recommended for those who have signs and symptoms.